In this video I wanted to show you guys the best budget robot vacuum cleaners that I've tested myself and therefore I can easily recommend them. As always you'll find all the links and show notes down below the video. Let me start with the cheapest model as it costs just about 120 bucks and it's called iLife V4. Despite a low price, I don't see a huge difference between this and more expensive models in terms of design and build. The cleaner is made of plastic and the build quality is good. We have the usual set of buttons on the top and wheels and brushes on the bottom. There is also amortization system that works well. The iLife V4 also has 10 sets of smart sensors built in that avoids the V4 bumping around or dropping off the stairs. Other key features include a 100-minute battery life, easy control with a supplied remote control, scheduled cleaning and various modes including edge, auto and spot mode. In addition, the vacuum comes with everything you need to get started including a few extra brushes and filters. The iLife V4 may not be the most powerful vacuum out there but it performs really well considering such a low price. It picks up dust, hair and even various crops and other stuff from hardwood floor and thin carpet with no issues. The vacuum also finds its docking station automatically with no issues and starts charging itself. It's really easy to remove the dustbin and this is the result of just 5 minutes of vacuuming. However, the vacuum lacks some advanced features like slam navigation system and suction power is significantly lower. All in all, the $120 iLife V4 may not be the best option if you have thick and fluffy carpets but it performs really well on the hardwood floor and thin carpets. Next up, Eureka i300 robot vacuum cleaner that costs about $260 on Amazon. The vacuum cleaner comes with everything you need to start using it, however it has less spare filters than the cheaper iLife model. On the other hand, you can immediately tell this is a more premium product than the iLife V4 as it has nicer design and slightly better build. However, the glossy plastic cover is a big dust magnet meaning that you will need to clean the vacuum itself from time to time. On the bottom we have a typical robot cleaner layout that consists of wheels and brushes. You can immediately tell this is a powerful robot cleaner as it sucks up dirt very well. Even this is not a real life scenario, I used oatmeal, rice, buckwheat and other crops in my tests and the vacuum had no issues sucking all of them up. I found all the security sensors to be working well which is really important if you have stairs in your house. Even though it may seem that the Eureka cleans randomly, the end result is really good thanks to SLAM technology. Other key features include scheduling system that can be controlled on the remote control. Also there are multi-cleaning modes like auto, zigzag, zone, spot and edge cleaning. The battery life is about 90 minutes. Finally, the robot finds its charging base automatically without any issues. Overall, the Eureka i300 is a great robotic vacuum cleaner with plenty of power and good overall performance. The Prosenic 811GB is an awesome robotic cleaner that can also mop the floor thanks to built-in water tank. The 811GB sports a classic robot cleaner design with a glossy plastic finish on the top and on the sides of the device. The overall build quality is very good. You can attach the included cleaning cloth to the bottom of the robot for mopping the floor. I was really impressed with the mopping performance and you can even choose how much water you want to use. There are three water penetration speeds, low, moderate and high. Also the Prosenic has a similar amount of power as previously mentioned cleaners, meaning that the vacuum performance is also very good. Keep in mind that the robot sweeps, vacuums and mops the floor at the same time which is really awesome. Obviously you can turn the mopping feature off. You can control the device either using the button on the robot itself, use the remote control or a Prosenic app that has Alexa support. The robot has 4 cleaning modes including Auto, Spot, Edge and Zigzag. We also have anti-collision and anti-drop sensors and the robot comes back to its charging dock automatically pretty fast. The Prosenic cleaner has one of the best batteries as it can clean up to 130 minutes on a single charge. 
Last but not least, the robot comes with plenty of accessories including extra brushes, filter, cleaning cloths and some boundary tape. Overall, the Prosenic 811GB is one of the best budget robot vacuum cleaners as it is just packed with features and has been working very well for the past 4 months. Now let's talk about more expensive robot cleaners. The Ecovax DBot 711 costs about 350 bucks on Amazon. The main difference between previously mentioned robot cleaners and this one is that the DBot uses S-shaped systematic movement. That means that the vacuum will go back and forth whereas other vacuums seem to be going randomly. On the other hand, the end result is pretty similar using both technologies even though the company claims their vacuum is better. In addition, the DBot 711 uses Smart Navi 2.0 technology thanks to additional sensor that is built on the top portion of the cleaner. That means that the robot does not clean the same place twice for better efficiency whereas cheaper models do that quite often. The DBot looks quite similar to other cleaners but it uses glass on the top and matte plastic on the sides. On the bottom, we have a standard set of brushes and wheels and the overall build quality is excellent. You can also connect the robot to your phone using the Ecovax Home app and control the robot from there. In addition, the device is compatible with Amazon Alexa and Google Home, meaning that you can control it by voice commands. Other key features include a maximum power mode, there are a lot of sensors that prevent the robot from bumping into furniture or falling off the stairs, auto recharge feature works fine and the DBot comes with everything you need to get started, including extra brushes, filters and the remote control that works well. The performance has been really good, it seems that the vacuum goes significantly faster than other robots but the end result is excellent thanks to good suction power. Overall, the DBot 711 has plenty of advanced features and it performs well both on hardwood floor and thin carpets, therefore I can recommend you checking it out. Xiaomi or its subsidiary brands like Roborock produce one of the most advanced robot cleaners for the money. Prices start at about 300 bucks for the basic models and go all the way to 550 bucks for the most advanced ones like the Roborock S5 which also carries the name of S50 or the second generation of Xiaomi Roborock smart vacuum. The S5 is actually one of the most advanced robot cleaners you can buy and it rivals other vacuums that cost twice as much. The device has both cleaning and mopping features, smart zone cleaning and the most advanced sensors available on the market. In addition, the suction power is up to 2000 PA meaning that it is twice as powerful as cheaper models I showed you previously. Further, the S5 uses LDS or long distance sensors that can scan its surroundings at 360 degrees to map your house or apartment. A 5200 mAh battery lets the vacuum work for 2.5 hours meaning that it can clean the house of 250 square meters on a single charge. You can also control the robot using the app, Amazon Alexa or Google Assistant. There are plenty of other advanced features of this vacuum cleaner and I will leave a link to this product as well as any other products mentioned in this video down below. Overall, I think that the Roborock S5 may not be the cheapest option out there but if you want the most advanced and powerful robot cleaner, no one can beat this in this price category. And now a few bonus devices for those who don't like robot vacuums but at the same time hate the bulkiness of classic cleaners. I've been using the Xiaomi Roidme F8 for half a year now and it's just awesome for the price of about 330 bucks. This is a broom style portable vacuum cleaner that has a really nice design, it is lightweight and really powerful. I've covered most of the features in my dedicated video review of the Roidme F8 so make sure to check it out. Another great cleaner is made by Puppio. It also has plenty of power, it has larger dustbin and longer battery life than the Roidme F8. Again, check out my detailed review of it and you'll find all the links and show notes down below the video. What do you think? Which is your favorite robot vacuum cleaner or do you prefer classic vacuums? Let me know what you think in the comment section down below and as always like the video if you liked it, please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and as always it was Linus, thank you for watching and see you soon.